Today is the last of the to-do list. They're working on the things that didn't get finished yesterday, wrapping up last minute things. The pickets are um, engraved on the inside when you're standing on the playground. And these are pickets that pe people purchased because they wanted to own their own piece of the Dream Playground. So they had them engraved. The murals are all in place. All they need to do is be sealed. After today, the Parks Department is going to work really hard to make it not look like a construction site anymore. We have 28 days and we'll be cutting the ribbon, so there's a lot of little finishing touches that need to be done, so that's what will be taking place here. The volunteers were amazing. We had 300 to 400 people come out per day for the last 10 days. So we believe there's probably over 3,500 people in our community that have participated in this playground in some way. Um, I, I really am speechless. Thank you just doesn't seem like enough. When you have people coming out here giving four or eight or 12 hours of their time, our build captains, some of them were here for 10 days for 12, 13 hours. That's like 120 hours on a construction site. Um, thank you just doesn't seem to be enough. Um, they can go to the K Kenosha Achievement Center website. They can also check out our fa Facebook page. We have a very active Facebook page and we're constantly, constantly updating things. And they can throw a like here or there if they'd like. Yes, we can. Actually, yes, we did.